Hi everyone. What the wonderful thing is about springtime, as far as I'm concerned, is obviously all the wild spring flowers that start to come out this time or, or are very abundant at this particular time. And we've just gone past the spring equinox up here in the uh, Northern Hemisphere. And um, the flower essence that most represents the spring equinox, as far as I'm concerned, within the eyes of nature range of flower essences is that of the, um, the humble primrose. Uh, but the primrose is such a delightful little flower with its heart-shaped petals and its lovely, almost like lime or, or lemon yellow type petals. It's just an absolute joy to behold as a, as a flower. And um, it's been with us since December this year, unbelievably. I, I couldn't, I was beside myself when I saw it in the hedgerows that early. But the message that it wants to bring to us all is all, all about new beginnings. And back in December, we had news as regards like the first vaccines for um, coronavirus being established by the likes of AstraZeneca and Pfizer and the possibility of new beginnings for our society of like coming out of the sort of lockdown situation that we've been in for just over a year now, you know, March uh, 2020. And uh, here we are 12 months on and still wrestling with the ramifications of COVID-19. So the Primrose brings us the quality of renewal and that there is always this opportunity of starting afresh and new beginnings. And from a bullying perspective, because what I do with Allies of Nature is I help people to um, overcome the effects of bullying in order to find their true identity or the, the strap line that I prefer to use is connected to this awakening to a life beyond bullying to claim your true identity uh, or true power, uh, beauty even. All of these sort of like qualities that get lost within us um, when we're bullied, when we're oppressed, when we're conditioned, when we feel trapped within our lives, when we are lost, when we feel as if we haven't really sort of achieved much in our lifetime when we were almost sort of like scared to look at ourselves in the mirror in the morning uh, at the, the man or woman that's sort of like staring back at us because we don't feel that we've really achieved anything compared to anybody else. But with the help of the primrose and other essences in the eyes of nature, range of flower essences, we always have the opportunity to start afresh, to have what is called a mulligan, you know, a start over, um, a renewal in order to start to achieve the things and do the things that we really want to do in life. And um, for myself, the more I connect with my own story of overcoming the effects of bullying myself, then the greater I am able to connect with people, the more I am able to connect with my own vulnerability. And that's what I hope to achieve in these videos that I'm doing for people or with people. And that is just to be able to express myself in front of the camera and my journey through my life is, with bullying has been like in order to find my own voice. Uh, going from an environment where uh, I had an unwritten rule within the household growing up as a child that children should be seen and not heard and I didn't have a, didn't have a voice and I've had to learn in various sort of like circles that I've frequented through transition towns or um, personal development centres, sitting in circle in council in the traditional way within the what the indigenous people would do around a campfire or whatever. I've gradually been able to speak my truth more and um, talk more about the things that I'm passionate about and I've made an absolute horlicks of 
presentations and uh, pitching ideas to councils and all sorts of things in the past but it's all taken me forward like step by step you know each time that I've had an opportunity to present myself or present an idea to people in a new way you know it's been a, a question of like you know again connecting with the spirit of the primrose in that sort of like renewal idea and a new beginning each new opportunity is a new beginning in order to be able to do something good with your life and that's basically what the primrose offers the primrose offers the power of yes compared to the wild daffodils power of no so the two work in conjunction with each other at this springtime phase that sort of like balance that we associate with the spring equinox the no of the wild daffodil the yes of the primrose and together we can say yes to the likes of allies of nature and everything that that offers for its flower essences, shamanic healing, life coaching, in order to help you to awaken to a life beyond bullying, to claim your true power. So if that interests you, why not PM me, get in touch with me, or visit the website www.alliesofnature.co.uk uh, forward slash shop if you want to engage with any of the essences. And um, otherwise, just peruse the site, see what takes your fancy, whether it's one of my transformation packages or engaging with the entire range of essences to support you through the year. You know, let's have a chat and let's um, start on what I call the butterfly journey together to move, evolve from a caterpillar into a butterfly and let's see what is possible within your life beyond bullying. So I'm just going to leave that for now and uh, get back to you next time with the next flower essence or the next thing that I need to speak to you about. But I just bid you goodbye for today and thanks for joining me.